are my dog in tow. If you are watching this in the future, this is all about hitting this magic little spot behind me here. Now, I found this a while ago, and for a few reasons, I held off actually working. I had to build a wing dam to get in here earlier to work that before this spot got smashed by potential other people, but more importantly, the floods that we've got coming in the very near future. Now, this spot in behind me here is going a pretty decent spec, spec count every single pan. Now, I'm gonna show you what I got for 20 shovels through the high banker out of the top minus minus. We're gonna flip this camera around. This is what I got for 20 shovels out of the top now it's a little bit hard to see because the camera wants to adjust to the black pan but there'd be a couple hundred pieces of gold in there and the mat is looking pretty good we got a lot of black sand like a lot so this is all now completely clear i even shifted this mesh down a little bit to add a triple layer of mesh in that mid section to hopefully reduce black sands even further now ferny girl you like, my, you like my wing dam? That took me an hour to build. It was so fast to car and it was really bad. I'm not gonna go into too much in terms of um, in terms of showing you test pans and whatnot at the start just because I've got the only pan I've got that's full of gold at the moment. Ah, oh, Chris, super chat. Thank you very much for that, buddy. Now, I'm gonna dig this out today. I was going to film, but for a few reasons, I've had, I've had, some, I've had a pretty bad week to be honest, <laughs> which I'll go into in the future, but I'm just going to dig this out today. So we've got to turn this pump on. Ah, set her up. And the on switch. Right, we had a little bit too much water running over it on the first run. I didn't get any losses in my tailings but I don't want to risk it. So, we're going to jump straight into it. Obviously, guys, I'm not going to be able to answer questions and dig and stuff at the same time. So, um, I'll periodically come up here and say g'day to everyone. We have 115 people watching. Welcome to Australia. If you've never been here, this is what it looks like. Let's move some dirt. Let's move some dirt. Where should we go? I'll put you guys up here, I reckon. Uh, hopefully, Burn doesn't knock you over. Maybe. Hang on, we'll get some good framing. We'll get some good framing. Why not? We can do that. It's a professional outfit. It's even level. Look at that. Oh, you're on a tripod. This isn't stick cam. We've upgraded.
at this. So this is the clay that I'm dealing with. I'm not 100% certain if the gold is sitting on it or in it. I would bet on it, but I want to try and dig through it to see what kind of layer is, is deeper down there. Uh, when I did a test pan, I scraped all this ground stuff off and I was getting 20 a pan. So that's not so bad. That's not so bad. Now, where is Fern? Fern, watch, heal. She might return. <laughs> Throw that in. Woo! Yeah, I even got it. All right. Ah, there you are. Hey, what's going on? I got no food, I got mud. Want some mud? Okay. All right, fine, fine. Well, all we can see is your tummy. Yeah. Ah, oh, set you guys back up. I'm going to try and get a hundred shovel run done. That's, that's kind of the goal.
caught our last stream, you will know all about uh, doing test pans as you work. So I knew that on the surface I was getting like 20 to 30 good pieces of gold. But now I'm much deeper and I don't know how much gold is actually in my pan. So we're going to just do this quick test pan and make sure we're actually on it. Wow. Well, I'll try and even get your level, guys. Here we go. Whoa, God, don't fall over. Stick cam would have never fallen over, I tell you what. So we've got this sort of grey clay. Usually that's quite barren. There's not normally very much gold in that. But if there's like five or six pieces in it, I'll keep digging through it just to see if I can't. Uh, fit another gravel layer underneath it because usually they're sluice tailing so if you, can, if you hit gravel underneath this grey clay you um you quite often hit original pockets of ground because they're very indicative of the sluice the dredge having come up Reedy Creek and deposited that grey layer not saying much like sand doesn't work well Four, four or five bits. Four or five. Oh, oh, we are digging in that. Holy crap. All right. Normally this clay is completely barren, but we've got a oh, bloody color grade here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen! Oh, oh, oh. fourteen, man. Hell yeah. That's a good pan. This is going to be a good day. This is going to be a real good day. <laughs> Whip it around. Um, we might just dump that in the sluice. Right. What I might do quickly is turn the pump off, have a look in the mats, because they're probably getting quite full. They're probably getting real full. So we'll have a look. See how much gold we're blowing out. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh wow. Alright. Alright. Well, that's um that's kind of annoying. This is still clear. This this whole section up here has got plenty of room left in it. Yeah. Yep. I don't know. Should I clean it out? I don't know. Is it packed? Are they hard packed? No, they're still loose. Loose-ish. Was enough. Hmm. If I could take a test of tailings, I don't know. I'm not sure. Questions. Questions, Fern. What do I do? Oh, I'm just being lazy. I don't have my bucket. Can you go get my bucket, please? Hmm. There's still plenty of room up that end too. I don't know. Should I let the laziness win? Can't see any like gold in the top, which means it's sinking. I just want to make. Uh, I'll try and take a thing from underneath the underneath the sluice. Wash this out properly. Make sure that it's not not contaminated, for any girl. And we're going to try to get a uh, sample from underneath the sluice. All the fast water will be blowing it back, so... But then it's hard to know if I'm digging up untouched ground, because like, the sluice obviously is sitting on ground I haven't touched or worked. I don't know! What I want to see is a shitload of black sand and absolutely no gold. But at 15 specks of shovel... Mm, any black sand. Mm, 
two pieces of gold that should not have escaped. All right, we'll do a clean out. We'll do a clean out. Set you guys up. Ah. How is it? A live stream from a live stream. So we're going to do a clean out. We've got gold in the in the tailings, but I don't have my bucket, guys. I don't have my bucket. And for obviously for reasons that I don't want to get into, I am not going to walk you back <laughs> to, to where I've parked my car and whatnot. So I'm going to just set you up here and I'll literally be back in like one minute when I come back with my bucket to do a proper clean out. Hold tight, Trev. I know I'm blurry. Okay. I bought a big bucket this time so I could wash this all out properly. Last time there was a lot of black sand left in that and that's not what you want. Here we go. This should be where there will be a fair amount of gold. Not heaps, 
but a fair amount because we did an earlier clean out so this has probably only got 30 shovels or so through it and the rest of it should be in that bucket burn oh you're just there that's all right cool i can work with that i can hear a car driving around which is um always good because you get visitors and because i'm bogus prospecting people are like hey let's have a let's have a chat and i'm like no worries at all but you're going to be on a live stream <laughs> All right, guys, we're not going to go, we're not going to go too hard taking this down. I'm not going to be able to really reveal it properly just because Reedy Creek Black Sand and Reedy Creek Gold are notoriously difficult to separate. I said, we're not, I'm not expecting a huge amount of gold either in this top one because I have already done one clean out. I don't really want to go any further than that. I'll be honest. Look at that. I don't know if you can make that gold out in the corner. But that's not looking too shabby. Bernie, come on. Heel. Oh, you're just there. <laughs> All right. This is the other way you, you can kind of reduce it without um, actually having to wash it out. But it's only going to show us a little bit of gold doing this. Like I can see gold up on these top riffles already. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Yeah, it's going to be real hard to see this, guys, because the camera keeps wanting to... It, the camera thinks that this is dark. So it keeps lightening everything and I can't manually change it because I'm using YouTube. But there would have to be oh, a few thousand specks of gold just there. Trying to get a nice line of colour for you to see. Look at that. And again, this is just like a sample. Man, we're gonna we, I think we're gonna have a good cleanup. I think we're gonna have a real good cleanup. So get that mosquito off the arm. Especially if we're at 15 specks of shovel down deep. That means it could be potentially even better. Right, now I've got to, I got to clean that out because the bed of the sluice has a lot of black sand on it as well. I'm thinking if I put the bucket in front and then tip pan down, but I need two hands for that. So you guys are going back on the old trap. I wonder if I can put you out here. Ooh, I could. Risky, risky because you're over the water now. If my phone goes in the water, guys, catch me.
we should have like about a hundred shovels in it. Hell yeah! Who managed to got here? We better say hello to a few people, eh? Looking for the comments coming up. There we go. Chris Hay. What's going on, man? 7.25 p.m. where you are. And yeah, you're going to get wet. Yeah, wet go. It's meant to thunderstorm today, so I might actually get rained on while this happens, which is really good fun. Jamie, welcome. John Pierce. I'm going to try and start this pump. Hang on a second, guys. Oh, it's all about efficiency and work, right? Oh, <laughs> not connected to the high banker though. Yeah, that was dumb. <laughs> it helps if you um, take the end of the hose, this, this, if you take this, and you attach it to the thing that's going to make you all your gold. Uh, I'm smart. I'm professional. Legs in. Yeah, something like that. Can I do this one-handed? This a... I have a tripod, Chris. Like, my God, bro. I have a tripod. That's like an extra three hands. Of course, it's all full of rock now, so it just wants to go on so well. Stop cross threading. Okay, you and me are gonna have words, pipe. Get on. There we go. Victory is mine. No, it's not. What? Okay. Okay. Just sit seat. Seat properly. No, stop cross threading. Mm, all the stuff you don't see in the videos. Oh, yes, victory. Ben, come on. Should it taste itself for wonders and find bees and then eat them and then I have to take it to the vet and pay several hundred dollars to get her fixed. <laughs> Be swollen. Now we shall turn the pump on. Burn, heal, come on. Oh, I might have to go up and get her a long way because she's starting to do that. Uh, I'm going to just do whatever I want to do, you know? Not what you want me to do. Victory! Yes! Perfect. Burn! Watch! Heal! Now! Come on! Yeah, we might have to go get a long line in a minute, guys, but if she comes back, we'll give her the benefit of the doubt. She's probably face deep in histamine at the moment. Burn! Watch! Heal! I shall start digging. Ah.
going on the long line. Which I'll have to go get. Sorry. Oh. Right. Fern does this distracted thing when she gets tired. And she starts being like, nah, I'm not going to do what you're going to do. What you want me to do. So I'm going to go get her a long line. And her. And lock her up to a tree. Like she's meant to be. And um, yeah, you. I see you. Then we're gonna get back to digging. The gold, the gold, the change is um, the change in the soil down there is getting really interesting, and I'm just starting to feel actual rain, proper rain. So who knows how long we've got left? Give me a minute, I'll be back. Tethered. Winner. It's actually starting to rain and I don't care. I'm a dig. Unless it absolutely downpours, I'm a dig. Uh, how's that look? Oh, you can see it. Beautiful.
how's this for a change? Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful place. So we're going to do a test fan. Because obviously I don't want to I don't want to stuff this up. I'm not gonna just drink dirt that doesn't have nothing in it. Don't knock over our guests. All 300 of yours, but you're right next to it. you guys but I'm getting pizza tonight. We're doing, I haven't done pizza in ages. We're doing pizza. Come on, big bucks. Big, 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 big. Oh my god, yeah, alright. It's the same. About 15. Yeah, fine, we're killing it today. Ah. <laughs> Funny girl. Hey? Funny girl. Oh, sorry. Itchies? Itchies. <laughs> yeah! Oh, Midas Mark prospecting. Hell yes, brother. I want a shlubel. If if anyone could make me a shlubel, I would be really appreciative because I want one. I'll tell you what, I really want a shlubel. <laughs> All right. I just saw a question regarding why I'm using this black cheap ten dollar pan and not like one of my potato pans or whatever other pan that I said that I've loved in the past. I'm not attached to my gear. I don't care. I'll use whatever works. And at the moment, I'm enjoying using this pan. And that's as far as it goes. And this is the best part about high banking. Now that I've done that test pan, I know every single shovel has given me 15 nice pieces of gold. It's like this. 15! That's why you test pan, that's why you keep test panning, and you only dig where the gold is good. Don't waste your time just digging big holes for no reason.
bedrock here. It's going to be a bit man, but... plans and the bar as well. Checking to see if I could see lines of black sand, and none yet. Alrighty. Holy crap. Whew. Oh my god. I guarantee you there's some nice gemstones down there. <laughs> Alright, as you can see there's no black lines in this. 
which indicates that we've still got plenty of room in the sluice box. Bernie, you're looking really depressed. Oh, okay. So, FYI, see how Fern's eye droops right there? Just there? That's her tiredness indicator. She is at 100% tired right now. <laughs> so, we're just going to get a test pan of where I'm up to now. Okay, let's uh, do this test pan. This clay, like traditionally every time I found this type of clay, it's kind of crunchy, it's not smooth. Um, I don't usually get very much in it, but if it's been consistent at 10 specs a pan, that's, that bodes really well that this is an old deposit and I could be here for a while shifting gravel. <laughs> Good, good placement. Oh, very good. You're showing off your best asset. There you are. If you sit down right now, you're going to get a surprise. Yeah. <laughs> yeah smooth, smooth bit of quartz. Come on. I'd love it if there was still 15 in there. I'm just uh, been digging straight down to try and find where the gold stops because normally you'll dig through a layer and it will be like, oh yeah, there's nothing in this, but. So far it's been all the way down, which means I have meters and meters and meters of dirt to move. Benny! <laughs> You're stomping your feet. I'm get into the slow a little bit. There's a reasonable amount of black sand in there. Fine stuff though. Normally you want coarse grain black sand not that super fine but i'll take it i mean if it's got gold with it if it's got gold i haven't seen any yet oh bro it's getting better oh my oh my god all right look at this i hope you can make it out the piece the particle size is getting bigger like, and hang on, let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 23! Holy crap! Holy crap! Holy crap! That's a lot. Okay, and we have got a, a fair show on a black sand in there. But these ripples are still staying pretty clear. I reckon, um... I reckon... We can probably keep going just because you know realistically speaking we no gold should be down here it should be mostly up here that's some big oh is that a nail i believe that is a piece of steel i can just go back in there oh well, we no we know we're going to be catching nuggets if that's at the top there's some of those big rocks down yeah look there's heaps of room in these ripples here but then again I don't know. I just hate doing cleanouts. They take forever. I'll see if I can see any gold. If I can see a piece of gold down here, then I'll definitely clean it out. But I can't at the moment. I can't see nothing. Nothing at all. Interesting. This is what we do, guys. This is just what we do on the creek. <laughs> Stare at the mats and be like, hey, do we clean it out yet, guys, or not? Hmm, mm, what's that? Oh, it's a rock. Who would have guessed that there's a rock in there? 15 pieces of gold. Oh my god, that's so much. I don't know. What should we do? I'm going to ask everyone. Yeah, and 
Guys, I'm on the creek in the middle of the bush. If the quality drops to shit, that's why. <laughs> it's not you, it'll be me. It's just, it, it is what it is, all right? So, what are we doing? We're gonna do, we're gonna do, keep trucking, better safe than sorry. Keep, whoa, what the fucking, oh, okay. We had a water droplet just go over the camera then. That's what happened. <laughs> that was fun, I felt like I was on acid. Keep digging, toss them in a bucket and keep running. Yeah, when in doubt, clean. All right, all right. I've convinced myself for cleaning out. There's enough black sand in there to warrant cleaning out. So, and especially if we're getting that much gold, I do not want to blow 24 or three or whatever it was specs of gold per shovel out. 23, 20 plus per shovel. That's freaking unreal, guys. That's real good. All right, so we're doing it. We're going to clean it out. Woo, flip the camera around. Woo. We've got people sending me messages too, Gadzi. Why aren't you in stream watching? Not talking. Bogus needs a joint. <laughs> nah, man, if I had a joint, I'd be like up there on that sand asleep. <laughs> uh. Okay, no, it's not going to do it. Uh. Doing all this one handed, it's so much fun. Oh, now I can get a really good look at the black sand, though. Man, we're going to have so much freaking cons to go through. It's going to be ridiculous. It's going to be brutal. <laughs> Hi, I'm live. Hell yeah, bro. Hell yeah. Has it been legalized down under? Hell no. Man, it took us like... It was like... a couple like 10 or 20 million dollar referendum just to legalize gay marriage it was pretty fun <laughs> when like the states had already done it weed is going to be a long 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 way off uh, being legalized here in australia i can guarantee you that we need a pan i'm a one-man army today too so just bear with the terrible filming and stuff uh, 400 people wow, what am i doing God, stop. Stay there. Don't move. Thank you. It's not hard. I'm not asking much. I'm doing all the work. You just have to sit there, Mr. Pan. Alright. Oh, get out of my hole. Get out of my hole. Get out of my hole. There we go. Come on, legs. All right, so, uh, I need to do that. Press that button. Oh, so many mozzies out here, holy crap. Getting eaten alive. All right, I just want to take, again, I'm just going to try and take the blonde sands off. I don't want to, I don't want to run it too down too far. I'd rather do all this clean up at home. But we just want to see what's in that top, top section of moss. Seen a little bit of gold, which is good. It's only fine, man, it's only fine. Interesting, that's got me worried. There should be more than that. Hey. You having fun? Yeah. Should be more than that, which makes me very happy that I cleaned out because we're probably shifting the gold down into the max. And that's not what I want to be doing. I want it to be caught in that top part. The sluice definitely isn't too steep. It's 
think it's just a black sand issue. Mosquito. <laughs> you escaped with your life that time, boy. Try this again. That can't be it. That can't be it. Surely not. God, it got me all scared now. Ah, oh, okay. I see what's going on. It's flat flake and fine grain black sand, and that means that the uh, gold is sitting in the black sand and not sinking underneath it. Because there's too much surface area on the gold flakes, so the friction from the black sand keeps it suspended in it, and I can't sink it. That's why we've got to do these cleanups at home. So that had me worried until I peeled it back properly. I'll show you a little bit of it. A little, 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 little bit. Ah, camera button, there we go. So this is some of it. Uh, like I said, the problem is, the big problem is that that black sand is so fine and that gold is quite flat and flaky, that friction is keeping it from settling in underneath it in the pan. Good thing we cleaned out because that's what happens in the high banker as well. Good, 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 good. That that makes me happy. I'll clean that mat out, guys. And Fern, where have you disappeared to? As usual, put you back on the long line. Fern, here, come on, let's go. Hey, you gonna help me? No, you're just gonna, you're just gonna stay over there, all right? Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> Turn off. Throw her tips, guys. <laughs> He's shaking it for you. Careful. That's heavy. That is real heavy.
mother of god 30 what are you looking at she keeps looking up there and it's making me super paranoid <laughs> oh my god so question 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 is uh i want to know how many shovels i actually run to get to that point so when i when i start shoveling if someone could um if someone could count the amount of shovels that are that are going into the going into the high banker and let me know when I stop, that'd be great. In the meanwhile, I kind of just wanted to see what one handful of concentrates gives us in the pan. Because I think that would be interesting. Oh, she's gone. She's done disappeared. Yeah. Yeah, we mustn't be there anymore. Drop bear, probably. That would make sense. Bloody drop bears. Is it like you guys are panning? Is anyone holding their phone and swirling it around at the moment? One handful. What do we get for a handful? There'd not be nothing. Oh no, we've got plenty of fines. Holy crap. All right. So from one handful, we got about the same amount of specs as we got from one shovel's worth of concentrates. I'll count them. One, two, 
3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. We've got 25 specs from one handful, and out of the hole, we're getting 20 plus, 20 to 25 per shovel. That is a good ratio. I'm happy with that. I can live with that. This should be a pretty decent cleanup. All right, so I'm going to turn the high banger back on. And if you guys could count how many shovels I do and let me know at the end of it so we can kind of get a bit of an idea. Burn, watch, heal. Got to get her back on the long line for this run. All right, get your shovel counting hats on, guys. Must have had a little bit of rain upstream because the creeks come up and now the front of the sluice is in the water.
I just had to adjust that water flow, guys. So it was a bit. The river's come up. I can't change the angles. So I have to change the water flow, and it was just not sitting quite right. But anyway, who cares? Oh, mama! Oh my god! Twenty-three. Is that all? <laughs> Feels like a million, man. Because the hole's so deep, you got to lift weight real far. Oh my god! Sorry, guys. I just got a message that Kaiser adds right back to. So. Uh, we've got to keep going. If that's only 23, I want to at least get to 50. Bernie, I know, Baba. Look how tired you are. Okay, you have a little bit of freedom. You get the idea now. There you go, free.
getting better. The deeper I go, the better it gets. This is a rare deposit. Normally, normally you get a paid layer, and as soon as you punch through it, nothing. This is gold from the surface to wherever. How many? Come on. How many did I get? What am I up to? 61! We did more than 50. Oh, I don't have to yell anymore. We did more than 50. Hell yeah! Alright. I'm stuffed. 61 shovels is a lot. Where did that dingus go to? God only knows. Who's here? Who have we got? We got heaps of people. Oh my god. What's going on guys? 339 watching. Man, okay, that hole's deep now. Fast water or a big hole? Which side do I want to step in? Oh, that one. Oh, I'm glad I stopped at 61. That's a lot. Now look at this. So that was, you, you guys saw it, full clean out to this. Oh my god. Absolutely packed with like this is double expanded mesh right so two layers of it and it's full it's absolutely full it's not hard packed though so that's good that'll allow gold to sink in oh my god hour and a half of streaming wow all right we've been going for a while now well oh god i'm gonna spend a little bit more time here i've got to have lunch and have a bit of a break and do some training and stuff with firm um all of which is kind of hard to do while you're streaming. So, I wanted to say a massive thank you to everyone who tuned in today. I won't delete this one, so you can re-watch the whole thing. I will make a full video on the cleanup of this. So, I'll go into detail about what I'm doing and, and all that sort of stuff. Um, and you'll see the results of whatever is in that bucket. I am probably just going to uh, maybe do two more runs or so. I've got to readjust the high banker onto that pile of uh, mullock as well and yeah so there's a lot of extra work but i thought i actually do another stream and just show you guys the whole process of what we go through every single time uh we come out now there are a bunch of questions i've seen come up thank you so much for your questions obviously i can't answer them while i'm digging and doing all this sort of stuff but until next time i will see you guys later and um yeah give you dog a scratch behind your ears for me peace bye